What's up guys, we're back with a Super 7 Turtles review, taking a look at the holiday themed exclusive for the year. We are of course talking about the Reaction 4 Pack uh, Santa Turtles basically that come in a Turtles themed stocking. So it's, it's a set of four figures in a very, very Turtles inspired stocking. So this is a huge nostalgia thing for me because I had a bunch of turtle stockings as a kid. Go figure, right? So this kind of takes me back a little bit. It is even sewn in such a way that it looks like a turtle foot and not just like an actual human foot. So it's got the the two toes right there on the front, which I thought was kind of cool. And then you've got some, you know, like a band with turtles cross cell and artwork on it. You've got the turtles logo embroidered on there and a little Super 7 tag up here on the cuff as well. But, you know, that's not the actual package. The actual package is, uh, is this guy right here. So it's a four pack of figures all on one card and it's done up in like a uh, you know like a gift tag type of thing so you've got the four figures there uh, in the window the turtles with their santa hats and christmas themed accessories you've got kind of a bow at the top and then the back of the box has a bunch of cutouts that you can pull from the box to actually make gift tags that are turtles themed so Definitely a very festive package. I love what Super 7 does when it comes to like the more exclusive and then holiday themed stuff. Uh, they always seem to check off a lot of boxes and I think this one uh, really does it, especially for someone like me who had, you know, a turtle stocking for years and years and years, still do actually, uh, as a kid. So let's do it. Let's pull them out and take a look. And here we go, out of the package, our Super 7 Reaction Teenage Mutant Santa Turtles. Of course, this is meant to be sort of like, you know, a gimmicky, fun Christmas present type of exclusive. So it's maybe one that not everybody needs because these are, for the most part, you know, uh, reissues, repaints with a little bit of a change up obviously, and then they've got some uh, changed up accessories. But we're going to run through them, show you what they can do, uh, see what they look like, and of course take a look at the stuff they come with as well. So I'm going to move a few of them back and we will pick my favorite turtle uh, to be our guinea pig here. So it is a reaction figure, so it's meant to mimic that vintage Kenner style aesthetic and of course articulation scheme when it comes to, to moving them. So classic, uh, classic, classic five POA action figure. So you've got a uh, swiveling head, you've got swiveling arms, you've got swiveling legs. So if you've messed with uh, one reaction figure, you really know what to expect here. Uh, these guys, of course, came long after this style of figure, but I do think they very much fit when it comes to what Super 7 is doing here. You know, I've got a, a handful, quite a few actually, of the regular Turtles reaction figures, and I think for the most part, uh, they all work really, really well, even though they really don't move a whole lot, but of course, that's the idea here. That's that's what they're trying to do, and I think they work uh, pretty nicely when it comes to that style of articulation. Of course, a lot of folks are very familiar with reaction figures at this point. It has it is a line that's been around for I don't know a really long time now, by all accounts. It's been around for a long time. So reaction is not a new thing. Uh, it's not new to turtles. What's really special about this set is, of course, that packaging. So of course the the four on one card back the stocking itself, and then of course just what's been changed up on the turtles. So we've got our base four turtles here, Donnie, Leo, Raph, Mikey. They all have their sort of signature colors, so Raph is a little lighter, uh, Mikey has a hint of teal, Leo is just kind of a dark green, and Donnie has that weird brown color but they are all very, very similar too. So they all share a lot of parts, uh, arms in particular, legs in particular, but then they have different torsos. Uh, you know, you've got the ones that have the uh, the crossed belts. They share uh, shell designs as well. And so Donnie and Leo share uh, some parts here. Raph and Mikey share some parts. And then a lot of their character, just like on the original vintage figures, comes through in these heads. So you've all got different expressions. So Leo's kind of gritting of the teeth to his left. Mikey's to the right. Raph is full on exposed mouth because of course he's he's the angry one. And then Donnie has got both sides of his mouth showing but not the middle. And then obviously the big takeaway is the fact that they have their unique color scheme for their flesh but also for their elbow pads, their wrist guards, knee pads, and bandanas. So they've got their signature colors and 
to top these guys off, the big, big difference outside of, well, what they're holding right now anyway, is the fact that this being a very Christmas holiday themed set, they do get these uh, Santa hats. So there's two different hats here at play. You've got uh, one that is going to the left, well, your right, and then Mikey is the odd one out here. His actually goes to his right, your left. So there is a little bit of a difference. Of course, one of them, specifically this guy, has to be the odd one out. And this is where I say that this is a set that's likely not for everybody because they are figures that we've gotten before, but they're just a holiday variant. I, in particular, really love this kind of stuff when it comes to uh, like Halloween and Christmas variant style figures. I'm all about them. So this kind of stuff speaks to me just from the kind of weird stuff that I like to buy and collect, but I think they work pretty well here. It's turtles and Santa hats. What's really not to like about that? I, I'd be down for Ultimates that did stuff like that, just like they did with the uh, the holiday He-Man years back. Not that not that they need ideas, but uh, I do think it would be a cool a cool thing to see. Maybe not necessarily have to buy, but but it'd be a cool thing to see. I don't need. Do I need more? We probably need more, but that's neither here nor there. I do think these look really good. Uh, paint on them is really clean and crisp. They're, again, very familiar territory for me because I've already looked at the first original set of turtles, but I like seeing these guys again. I think that this design for turtles, despite the fact that they are not anything from this era, they're not close to the reaction era of toys. Uh, they came much, much later. I think they look good as reaction figures. Uh, some of the figures in particular in the Turtles line just really work. Bebop and Rocksteady in particular look great as reaction figures, but I think the Turtles here in particular uh, do lend themselves really nicely to being pretty fun reaction figures, and then to get the holiday change-up does add a little bit of fun to them. And then, of course, we do get uh, our changed-up accessories. So we've got kind of like a candy cane uh, vibe going here when it comes to all of their accessories. So Mikey's got the candy candy cane nunchucks. Raph has got the candy cane Psy. Leo's got the candy cane katanas. And of course, Donnie rounds it out with a candy cane bow staff. But that's not everything because they, they all come with a piece of candy cane uh, style pizza. So you get four pieces of pizza. They're all the same as far as what they look like. But you do get uh, four of these. So each turtle can have their own slice of pizza and a weapon and it's all holiday themed it's all candy cane themed and it all kind of rounds out the set so a stocking for the package santa hats on the turtles candy canes for the weapons it all it all comes together in one very spirited delivery so yeah, this is a pretty fun set, and I think that's ultimately what this one comes down to, is that it's a fun set, and you don't necessarily have to have it. Uh, that's what Super 7 does pretty well when it comes to a lot of exclusives and variants, is that this is one you don't have to have. It's the turtles with Santa hats, with candy cane weapons, and coming in a stocking. You don't necessarily have to have it. You've already got your turtles maybe, but if you like variants, if you like holiday themed toys, if you like to set up a Christmas display with a bunch of Christmassy figures, well, here's four turtles that are very specifically themed to that idea. And, and I think it works pretty well, no matter how goofy it is. I think it works uh, really well. So that's going to do it for this look at the Super 7 Santa Turtle Reaction 4-Pack. Let me know what you guys think. Feel free to like, comment, subscribe, and share. And until next time.